what's going on everybody back again i'm back again with another video you know what i'm saying leave a like comment subscribe and this is gonna be a quick video y'all can see by the title new updates to content manager i'm gonna show y'all how to get traffic offline this is in single player some of y'all might want to play single player you might not want to play online Whatever your reason is, a lot of people have been commenting. They've been talking about the objects inspector and it's telling you to add this into services.ini. And a lot of y'all don't know how to do that. So we're gonna simplify it. Leave a like on this video, leave a like on this video. So first what you wanna do is you wanna go find a map. And for that map, I'm gonna leave the link to the example I'm gonna use in the description. This is SRP, Shotoko Revival Project. You're gonna to wanna to find the traffic planner for that map. You can type it into Google, you can type it into Reddit, do what you gotta do. I chose Shotoku Revival. And there's a new feature on Content Manager. A lot of people didn't know this. If you go up here to single player, choose a car, choose your track, and you come down here, there's practice, hot lap, race, track day, weekend, drift, drag race. What you wanna click is drag race. And there's a new feature if you scroll down here that says traffic. Now, when you get in the game, you are not going to be able to control the traffic. Everything starts before you get in the game. You have to have the traffic planner installed. If you're missing the cars, go install the cars. You can come down here, number of cars in traffic 200. Anything over 400 is gonna be a lot of traffic and you're barely gonna be able to drive. 200 is an okay amount, but you can play with this number right here. And the top speed limiter, you can put that up because you're gonna be driving fast, of course. But you just wanna come down here, drag race traffic. Once you do that and you have the traffic pointer installed, that's it. The game will run the traffic for you. Maybe because this is a modded track, all these warnings don't mean anything, guys. All you have to do is make sure you have everything you need to have installed and it will work. And how you would know if you did it right, if you have everything you need to start the traffic, you wanna come back up here after you select drag race traffic, come back up here to your map and it's so cool. They will tell you now, traffic planner ready and the maps will be here. The only, the reason I have no list here to search is because the only one I have ready for traffic is SRP. And once you join in, simple as this, we have traffic going. I didn't have to turn anything on. You cannot use the object inspector, which was the old way of doing it, but the game is simply running the traffic for you. It'll work perfectly fine. Now it's a new feature, but it'll work perfectly fine if you do everything the way I just told you. The only way you mess this up is if you either don't have the cars or don't have the traffic planner. Now they'll start off light and they'll start off in the left two most lanes. But as you get to driving on and on, the cars will fill up, they'll change lanes. They actually change lanes, which is crazy. See? So yeah, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and let me know did this work out for you guys. Also, let me know about my graphics right now. Do you think they look better than they used to? I want to drop a graphics video. Appreciate y'all, man. Also, if you do crash like I just did and the cars get built up on the highway or they stop or there's anything you can literally just click escape and you can go to restart session and it'll restart the whole session with the traffic.